In a world where titles are many and plots are few, one man can take your movie names and make them come to life. What is going on? Adam Carolla stars in Made Up Movie. All right, I'll get started. I'll hit line four and we'll talk to Clinton. Clinton, 28, Wisconsin. How's it going? Good. All right, so movie title for you would be The Dirt Lot. Have How? a take on the Sam lot. You know, I'm a big fan of the summer blockbusters. Yeah. Back in the, back when I was a kid, you know, a big big baseball fan, definitely still. All right, the dirt a lot. How fan. about how about we do like when I was a kid, a movie called The Wiz came out. Mm. It was the all black version yeah. of the Wizard of Oz. You did it in high school. What if we did the dirt lot is the black version of the sand lot, but football? Kevin Hart's the coach, you know, <laughs> and they got to go up against the big Christian school that's got the artificial surface and everything, and they got their broken down. Sure. You know, it's Terry Crews played Ter- football. Terry he Crews. Good, Samuel yeah, Jackson's the coach. Is Bubba Smith still alive? He could be the coach. Who? Bubba Smith. Oh, Bubba Smith is, is gone. He's still I'm, I'm, so I'm pretty it. sure. Okay. And Warren Sapp could be the coach. We we there kid. You go. Yeah, he's super appropriate around kids. <laughs> That's so we. What do he do? <clears throat> I don't know. Actually, <laughs> I don't. I don't think he want him <laughs> house sitting. Yeah. That's all I'm saying. I want Carl Weathers right. to be a part of this. Weathers makes an appearance. Yeah. Reginald Bill Johnson. Reginald Bill Johnson. Reginald Bill Johnson. Always. He played a cop though. He has he's a, a workhorse. <laughs> Maybe yeah, he's always high school open. security guard. <laughs> yeah, that's, yeah. that's a good one for him. Warren Sapp admits <laughs> to buying sex toys for four. <laughs> Co worker. All right, there that's why you don't want Warren Sapp in this area. That's oh, yeah. why you right. need it. That'll, that'll hurt PR. We'll audition him, but we won't give him the job. <laughs> yeah. We'll yeah. let well, him know we consider it. It's a favor read. Humor. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody knows him from back in the day. Because you have a Super Bowl <laughs> ring, we're gonna hear we're gonna we're gonna bring you in. I mean, you were in the casting game. How do you yeah. handle that when you know the person's not gonna get it? Oh man. I mean, I was I wasn't making any of the real calls, but I would see uh, yeah, that type of stuff would happen. Somebody probably there was like, oh, look, I was grew up being a Bucks fan, man, and I was at the game. I just they just want that moment with yeah, him even then him. yeah he's not gonna get it um so it's a it's an all black pop warner you know little league football team against the preppy christian against school. the preppy christians it's school almost like the way the mighty facility. ducks had played the uh, in the second one uh against the all the what the russian team uh, oh well speaking of the russians we have a rocky three Rocky Four, I can't remember. Like training montage where that's Rocky Four. <laughs> four, the training montage with the prep schools got all the world class yes. weights and the, the whole equipment, and the, the equipment. sleds, and the, these guys yeah, are the, pushing truck tires in the yeah, dirt, you yeah. know. Oh, yeah. And they got the my high school. <laughs> yeah, and they got, but they're kicking it old school, dragging a log, you know, with a rope around their waist and everything. There's got to be love found. <laughs> At some yeah. point, yeah, you you have like a yeah, maybe it's almost a la the Sandlot, Clinton. I think you've got like a Squints type character that maybe um, finds love with the you know uh, the Christian schools, the quarterback's girlfriend oh, somehow befriends for Britain, ah, yeah. befriends one of the uh, cheerleaders from the other ah, from the Christian there school. It is, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah. Female works. girl kicker. Sure, right. I've got to have a girl kicker. There's sure. got to be like a flea flicker play. You know what I mean? Like they have a secret play that the Christian school could never even imagine of. Mm-hmm. Yeah, like Mighty Ducks had the flying V. The handoff, so, yeah, little giants. the reverse, the handoff, the throw the back to the quarterback. Statue of Liberty. Yeah. Hook and lateral. Yeah. Human centipede. Human <laughs> centipede. Two girls in a cup. All the, yeah, all the I mean, we're spitballing here, but there's, yeah. yeah, we're not far off. <laughs> And there's also only like <laughs> every player on the team has to go both sides. Like it's that yes, poor both of a yeah. small school. So yep. you're playing offense and then you're going to defense and they're getting hurt. Yep. They're right. getting taped up. They got to go. They're completely the underdog. Who plays the announcer? This yep. is a great part. Who plays the guy? That, that's perfect. I got the perfect stadium for you too. Actually, my high school would have been perfect for it. It had one side as uh, the, the way team side is this small little stand and the big home team side is this massive. They built it like a college stadium for absolutely no good reason to be a high school stadium. Perfect. The high school entirely is shaped in a number one. The actual layout of the school, it's crazy. 
So I think I, I think it. Matt Walsh could what do is the announcing. Calls? I, I, oh yeah, you're yeah. I, you know, it's not why we go further uh, than the, oh, yeah. than the room. Matt, here. there's a fat. Well, uh, sure, you I'll crush do it. That. But no. I mean, I love Jason Bateman and Dodgeball. You would yeah, crush that, or yeah. Andy Daly, or yeah. Will Arnett. Some fast yeah. talking like yeah. Well, 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 one's a color commentator and one is a right. play-by-play guy. Yeah, who's so Bob Euchre and who's uh, the other yeah. guy from yeah. Major League? Yeah, yeah. we also got to have some <laughs> ringers in there, too, like Troy Aikman has to pop he, in. He's and, the dad of the quarterback of the Christian team. Yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah. He's, he's like, I don't has, want my son playing. Has to be a know. couple of ex-NFL or, you know, you have get, in the booth. Yeah. get Billy Sims in here, maybe Bosworth, yeah. you know what I mean? Some Sooner <laughs> legends. Horn you know Sass I mean? going to be pissed. Horn Sass going to be Sap. real mad. Yeah. Maybe he makes a cameo and he's like, you know, I got some toys in my trunk. <laughs> maybe we cast Warren Sapp's brother just to piss him off. Yeah. Because mm. how did I not get this? <laughs> we'll get uh, maybe LT. Oh my sure. God. LT's good. Marshawn. Michael Strahan might give us a day. Marshawn yeah, Lynch. Just for like a, half a day. day out of Strahan. He's busy. Uncredited, but we'll get yeah. him in there. All these kids' parents are ex NFL players. <laughs> yeah. That's actually great. Yeah. Well, maybe that's what it is. There's a dad. Here's what it is Aikman's like a super racist Christian dad, and he challenges the dads of the other team to, uh, to like a, a flag football game. And mm. all the dads are NFL greats, and mm. Aikman's buddies are not. Mm. Mm-hmm. And then uh, they battle to the death. and... But I think we got to keep it contemporary too. Like we got to torn from the headlines. Like we need like a trans kid yep. who at the Christian school can't play for the boys team because the the Christian school comes over to the dirt lot yeah. team yeah. where it won't yeah. be judged. Yeah. We have a very here. pivotal scene yeah. where the young, you know, eleven year old black kid goes, "I've been judged my whole life." And everyone just kind of looks down, you know, and yeah. finds a home. Yeah, yeah. tomato That's score mo- just went up ten percent. That's a moving yeah. scene, right? And there. maybe the game has no effect on the conference. It's just one of those games for glory and value. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like it's not an official mm. district game That's for a right. championship. Somehow they arrange it like, well, all right, we'll just play you to see who's better. But it it's doesn't like at count. the end of Rocky Two, where he gets Carl Weathers back in the ring alone at the gym and ah. does the ding ding. Yeah. That, that's just for them. They're yeah. just proving it <laughs> yes. to each other at this point. And I wouldn't mind getting greedy. We do a motivational halftime speech before and after every quarter. We just load the we, movie we ta- with motivational, motivational speeches. halftime mm-hmm. speeches. We need that mm-hmm. for the trailer. And we even bring in, you know, whoever, like some charis- like Sam Jackson comes in because mm-hmm. he's a hot dog vendor. Right. He wants to say something. So we get him after quarter one. Right. And then halftime, maybe we get the coach. Right. Thir- after third quarter, I don't know who could come in. Great additional deleted Barber, scene. Tiki Barber. Tiki, Tiki Barber's got to be in there. Or yeah. Ronde. Uh, or Ronde. Tom Geary, who plays. <laughs> no one's going to know. Them both. Tandem. I'll get Ronde and we'll call him Tiki. <laughs> because no one's going to know. Well, hear me out. Tom yeah. Geary, who played Scott Smalls in The Sandlot, I think there's one quick scene where they're playing, they're practicing on the dirt lot, and a baseball flies over the fence, mm, and wow. he just goes, and he goes to grab his ball and goes, sorry, guys. Yeah, yeah. And everyone's like, well, and he's wearing the nice. same hat. Just nice. a little like Easter egg, right? Yeah, nice a little, Easter egg. Little Alfred Hitchcocky yeah. in the front of the movie. Uh, he doesn't have to wink the camera, but maybe the do- maybe he's carrying the dog that uh, that uh, James Earl uh, at the had. beginning. The at the beginning, I hate all roads to lead to Stallone, but in the beginning of the <laughs> they always do, Adam. In the in the movie where Travolta played the dancer, like Saturday Night Fever Two or whatever. Yeah. Look who's talking. Whatever it is, he was walking down the street and banged into Sly. At the beginning, do you remember oh, that? Sure. It came yeah. Like, yeah. He hey, them? Yeah, yeah, where are you going? And it was a quick homage to yes. Sly. We I do like that those. with the actual Sandlot. Yes. All and right. I think the referees have been corrupted, by the way. I think uh-huh. the Christians uh-huh. have Great paid call. off. Yeah. Aikman's uh-huh. paid off the refs. Aikman's oh, paid off the yeah. refs. Mm-hmm. That gives us Good another memoir underdog element. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's not, he didn't hand him cash, but Aikman runs the Chevy dealership. Sure. And there's that conversation where he's Look talking. Of course he does. He's talking to the ref and goes, you know, but a couple months late on that Silverado payment, I hate to have to send the tow truck by. <laughs> Oh, you know what I mean? And yeah. God, he looks like he'd say that. Yeah. yeah. Also, but, he's uh, got a real sp- long is also involved at the right. Christian school. Great I don't call. know if he's right. the principal or the mm-hmm. booster, the big booster. Yeah. It's, it's late. It's, it's almost longest yard to ask. And yeah. it's just like chock a block filled <laughs> yeah. with NFLers and jocks. Right. Yeah. Yeah. And Aikman's cheating on his hot wife. Mm, he's cheating on his wife. You don't feel bad for this guy. And he's got no. he's got the linesman or the head ref. He's got him in his back pocket because mm-hmm. he's a couple payments late on that. Maybe Silverado. The, the narration device is like in Princess Bride, where it's a grandpa 
talking to his grandson about the greatest game he ever played. Ah, and so yes. we can go back. Ooh, so we can off. set it in any era. We could go 50s, 60s, 70s, 80s. Starts but, on the porch. Yeah, starts on the porch. Yeah, That's he's right. like, you know how I got this scar, young man? Right, or whatever. Right, this right. finger, it's got a crooked finger. Right. I don't regret it. Right. Why not, Grandpa? Because it reminds me, boy. <laughs> It reminds It was me. never recorded, but it happened. <laughs> the greatest game ever. Right. The greatest yeah. game ever greatest played. Game, well, we got to stick to the name. Yeah, the yeah. Dirt, dirt, dirt Lot. The Dirt, dirt Lot. lot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. I've been a lot of places in my day. Yeah. Yeah. The Dirt Lot was one of them. Yeah. Whoever does it. I don't know who <laughs> All that is. All right. Do you guys Freeman. see a, a line you uh, <laughs> a like up there? Yeah, let's do line two. Uh, line two. Yeah, dances with line coyotes. Line two. Oh, see? Remember the talk. Line two. Even use line two as an example. Jason? Sorry, line two. Hey, how you doing? Good. 49, Chico, California. That's right. I got a movie for you. It kind of writes itself. Mm -hmm. It's Dances with Coyotes. Mm -hmm. All right. This is a young group of kids making their way to Tijuana. To have some oh, fun. Looking for the donkey show. To go looking in. For the, looking for <laughs> go the into show. Mexico. They go Usually into they, Mexico. They bring them in to they, the U.S. And I okay. think they call themselves like the you know like the the greasers or the um, like the coyotes is the name of their like friend gang. Right. Mm -hmm. But they go and they can't get back. Mm, I got it. Oh, it's I a like group that. with their friend gang, the coyotes. And they're from New Mexico, and they think it's a, a, a cute name and everything, but. <laughs> At some point, they're mistaken for real coyotes. Ah. It's that, you know, they, they do this in movies a lot where yeah. they think, you know, they did it in uh, Moon Over Parador where they thought <laughs> Richard Dreyfus wasn't really the king. I don't remember. But yeah. the point is, is like people go, like, you got to talk to the coyotes. They'll get you back into whatever. And next thing you know, this guy's wearing coyote bomber jackets. And then, but the hot chick turns out there's love because it's a beautiful young woman who just wants to get back to the United States to be reunited with her son. And even though they're not the coyotes, the guy falls in love with her. And of course, he w tells her, "We are the coyotes. I can help you do this. Like, shut up." But then, of course, the real coyotes. Now we got to. Uh, how about we go full against type on the real coyotes? Mario Lopez. Sure, we grow some facial hair. Oh, yeah, he no, I'm talking about the badass coyotes, the guys oh. who work for the, the cartel. This, he needs a tough. But Mario role. Lopez is an attractive. Guy. He's got no saying, very attractive that's what I'm man. saying. Yeah. We, yeah, yeah. we ugly him up. We, he goes. Yeah. Against I don't think he's going to be okay with that. Uh, I, he's, a, he's a friend. He, I, yeah, we can he, make a call. He wants. Mm -hmm. He wants a little bit of an image change. He's tired of being on the hotel right. screens all the all day. Like he needs something a little rough, something well, he I'm, could sink his teeth into. I'm jumping to the Tijuana car chase. Like we can mm -hmm. blow shit up in that town, right? Oh, like we yeah. can have overseas Lawless. containers and like, oh yeah, you know, like poor neighborhoods and laundry. We can Set really on fire. Totally, two some two wheel driving like they did on chips. Like just yeah. do it up. Yeah. Yeah, just yeah. like spend. 15 minutes in the car chase. I yeah. think that'd be a lot of Michael fun. Michael Bay-esque. Yeah. yeah. And then Mark Wahlberg is a border agent. Oh. Trying to help these guys out. Trying to help. Right. <laughs> we got to have the mounted uh, La Magre whipping the guys with, uh, you know, the bull whips from the horse. Oh, the migrants. Always fun. The Haitian migrants. Yeah. Oh, come on. Yeah. Let's not go political. Yeah, <laughs> we got a good story here. Yeah, we're, we're trying to appeal to the masses here. We got the coyotes who are a fun friend gang who are mistaken for real coyotes at the border, and the hot love is found. They get through the car chase. Maybe yeah. Eva Longoria. Explosions. I don't know. Eva would she, sure. She'd good be director. great you, as the love interest. Yeah, she'd be amazing as sure. the love interest. How old are they? I, I thought the. They're are a the coyotes younger. like teenagers? It's a like, May you December want... type situation. Oh, oh, so you so. want like a twenty year old oh, and a forty five year old? Well. <laughs> Hey, Blank Check did it. She, Blank Check, the, the right. kid was 12, and the cop was on a There's no was bad like 40. Ideas. I'm I in. Okay. Yeah. Well, she's <laughs> only feigning affection for him, okay. who's truly smitten, oh, because okay. she wants to get back and reunited. Okay. Now, what we find out is eventually when they are reunited, this is the end of, of uh, the third act, she finds her young daughter, who's 19 and beautiful. Oh, by no, the way, and we have that interest. scene where he looks at her, and now we get it. We do the uh, math after right. that. You put it together. See what I'm that saying? Point. Yeah, that okay. Together. I like that. Mm -hmm. yeah. What is it rated? Uh, it's it's a PG-13. Okay. I, I, I was going for NC-17, but we can... So it. it'll be on mm -hmm. TBS. <laughs> yeah, I think, Jason? I think PG's the way to go. I love it. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, we did it. Right, love Print it. it. Thanks, Jason. All right. Classic Chico. Oops, sorry. Hit the wrong... Damn it. 
there we go. Hit the wrong button. Oh man, I'm pretty pumped about number one. Number I like one. Out of Bounds. Yeah, oh, yeah. because it could go anywhere. Well, let's see what the title. Will be. <laughs> let's see what the title is. Oh, sorry, <laughs> yeah, Phil, I just did it too. I man. tried. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. We'll dig it out and post. <laughs> yeah, thank you. I wonder what it, the title is. <laughs> Philip Forty, Minnesota. Yes. Hello. We're all on pins and needles over here. What is the name? Out of bounds. Ah, it's really out great, of dude. bounds. First, I've heard of this. I mean, right. it's you know, it's got to be some sort of basketball film, no? Well, no, it's whatever, whatever. If if you, you want to take a that's turn, where my head it's, goes. It's whatever. My head goes to um, Tony Danza's coaching <laughs> a wheelchair basketball league. Oh, I like this. because oh, I murder like ball, wheelchair. murder yeah. ball, yeah, yeah. and. Um, I think he's, you know, a la Ben Affleck in, I think it was the way back. I don't know if Danza's I, got a drinking problem. I got to take care for He's you. got a fentanyl problem. Go ahead. It's a, it's a murder ball type situation. Okay. Basketball wheelchair. Mm -hmm. But at some point, one of the guys is, you know, can't play, ill or whatever. And the coach has to convince an able-bodied guy, like we need a <laughs> ringer. Pretend? You oh. got to get in the in the wheelchair. This guy's a full stud and He's played good. played at a high level and stuff like that. But he pretends to be in a wheelchair. Yeah, pretends to be in a wheelchair, just like Rodney Dangerfield did with Jonathan Brandis and Ladybugs to pretend That's to be right. a girl. And uh, Johnny Knoxville did in like special ed yeah. or yes. whatever. Yes, yeah, whatever there's, actually, it was. there's actually a scene where a basketball rolls on the court and John, Jonathan Brandis grabs the ball and walks off. It's a little like homage to uh, Ladybugs. Yeah, so we'll, sure, we'd have to dig him up first. Though, but dead, but Chris, at but some yeah. at some point, the ball's bouncing around. This guy was an all league player in college and in high school and everything else. And at some point he just springs out of his wheelchair, jams the ball as like posterized bitches Couldn't and help himself. And everyone looks at him and it's like, Oh, and then he's like standing and he does a comic move where he's like, I can feel my legs. It's kind of Eddie it's Murphy kind of thing. Like it's a miracle line, but now they're out. Now they're out. He's out. So and okay. now it's only four guys. So now Dan's has to man. reunite the group, right? Because well, now they're down and out. I have another pitch. Yeah. Cut to 20 years later, and that guy is now actually in a wheelchair. Oh, yeah. Diabetes. Yeah. Mm. The guy who dunked on people mm. actually and he is really now a And now he wants to maybe go back and coach. No, he's been banned. No, well, but he wants to coach, right? And he meets up with Danza, and he's like, you know, I fucked you then. Like, give me some advice. And Danza goes, just because your legs don't work doesn't mean your heart doesn't. Oh, <laughs> there's there's the heart one, yeah. That's, he's that's kind of a trailer. <laughs> that's in the trailer. But I... I, and he winks the camera as he says it. I think Matt's right in that he kind of turned into the Bill Buckner of the handicap yeah. league. Like he He's was hated. He was hated. No, everyone remembers that scene. You know, it was on, and we do this. We, we cut to sports page at yes. local that night. All the clippings. pictures and newspapers yeah. and stuff. Now he's actually in a wheelchair. People oh. don't believe him anymore. And he's got to find grace. He's so, got to find his way back. Yeah, yeah. And so, redemption. Uh, so out of bounds is, I guess the, I guess, uh, alludes to him pretending to be a paraplegic and just like you're out of bounds for doing. Like, where do we get yeah, that cheating? Yeah, kind yeah, of. yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. So now he's back in. He's coaching. Did Danza make him coach, or did Danza so. put him back in the chair? I think there is a the scene team. where they see. You know, he's you know almost the way <laughs> that uh, he's like, well, good to see you again. Yeah, I just. Uh, I mean, you fucked up back then, mm. but we all fuck up. I'm fucking up right now. I just put 60 bucks on the Mets. You do the Fs, we're going to get the 17. We're going to get the uh, R. Yeah, you I'm okay with that. That's the R. I right think you're now. not going to be able to get Danza unless he can curse, because I think he's at that point in his career, post-tap dance, <laughs> where he's like, I got to be me. Mm. Well, we have to have Danza, obviously. Gotta have Danza. <laughs> I mean, that's, or we don't get funded. Thanks, yeah. Matt. <laughs> yeah, right. Because well, it's not going to be a small budget film. Yeah, we want look green lit. I, yeah, it's, I, I did especially international. <laughs> I was in that porn China. movie with Joseph Gordon-Levitt, and I think <laughs> I, I, I didn't. I know the producer. Maybe they get a game in Russia. Maybe they play mm, the yes. Russian team yes, or I love some that. country. Maybe uh, who do we hate more than Russia? I guess Russia works. Yeah, still. Russia's, yeah. Russia's, Russia's good. It's good because you always want the right bad guy. Mm -hmm. Iran. Mm -hmm. We can go wherever North Korea. Eh, Iran's got the word "run" in it. Okay. If you really think about it, All these right. guys are in North wheelchairs. Yeah. So. Yeah. All right, stick with Russia. Stick it with always Russia. works. Okay, Russia always works. Philip, I fell an Oscar. That was fantastic. <laughs> oh, I knew it. Finally, 
<laughs> All right, we'll do one more. Wait for who? David, 33, South Texas. Oh, did I pop? Yeah. Oh, I hit four. Sorry. C3? Sorry. There's three. David, Yo. what's going on? Yo, hey. Mm. I got one. Um, Bought the farm. Oof. There must be, first off, this movie title's been made. You're so, thinking of We Bought a Zoo. <laughs> that's right, where my that's mind went, too. Yeah. yeah. It's got to be. A, this is an Elon Musk type. He needs love. He goes on Farmers Only, which is an actual dating Oh, my app. God. I love mm-hmm. this in. Right? Mm-hmm. He matches with somebody who he thinks is the love of his life, but he's not a farmer. So mm-hmm. what does he do? He buys a he farm buys an actual and farm pretends. And pretends he's a farmer, but, oh, comedy ensues. Right. As he's trying to milk a cow. <sighs> yeah. Can we put him into, like, he's trying brilliant. to milk a bull. Can, <laughs> okay, right? Yeah, can we put him into juice. like uh, an Amish community? So he really has to swear off technology even. Yes. So he's mm-hmm. got the beard. Maybe he grows it or it's fake. But he's a bigwig. He needs that phone. So he has he's, to, yeah. He's hidden it. Yeah. And so they're always mm-hmm. like, what's that? It's in the that? butter churner or something yeah. mm-hmm. when he's alone. Mm-hmm. But he's going in full on, doesn't can't use this technology. Yeah. And there's great comedy because they're so aloof and out of the uh, loop that if he, I mean, you could really go big with it to where they're like, what's that device? Right. Yeah. He they don't even know like what a phone is. Like, like I don't know. They're so. I don't know. I mean, that's great. <laughs> he's like, I'm sending a text. A yeah. who? Well, obviously they don't. They probably don't even recognize him, right? Cool. He, sure. He's recognized everywhere else. So this is yeah. the only place they don't have he can TVs. Go to. This yeah. is the only community get where he Jessica can. Jessica Chastain to play this because that one was a chameleon. Yeah. Oh, yeah. She could be the she's love great. interest. I mean, yeah. she's yeah. solid. Farmer's daughter. Right. She'd be great. Yeah. And so there, there's a lot of that. Mr. Mom jokes where she's like, well, why don't you just hop on the hay baler and, and I'll meet you after. And he's like, oh, yeah. He starts walking to like the tractor or something. And, you know, the, no, he said the hay baler, hon. Oh, yeah. No, I was yeah, going to take the tractor over to the hay baler. That's all. Why would I you know. do that? Yeah. I know the difference between a truck. Come on. I grew up on a farm, you know, but it's a, a lot of Mr. Mom jokes. Yeah. Where he's like, oh, 110, 120, 220, you know, whatever those those fish out of water jokes are. Yeah. A barn ra- We'll do a barn raising. Maybe he figures out some cool contraption with ropes and they're impressed. Like, right. figures out a lever. Well, kind there, of that's a montage series. Yeah. And, and, and I'll tell you why. Because there's the old timer who has the farm next door who's on to him. Yeah. And he thinks he's going to out him. But instead of outing him, he teaches him what a sheep shank knot is <laughs> and, how to how to bale hay and how to bind it, and he starts giving them all the terminology. Because he never had a son. Yeah, there's a little there's a little kind of Mr. Miyagi vibe to yeah. it, you know, because he 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 doesn't want the ruse. Yeah, yeah. But now, at some point, the chick finds out, and that's mm-hmm. always that big turning point. How does she find she, out? She finds out. I I think it. She has to see him somewhere. He's like watching it, porn. His. <laughs> No, no, I think I think like in the media somehow or uh Yeah, like maybe maybe somebody recognizes him at the grocery somebody store. Somebody comes back from Rumspringa. <laughs> maybe he runs huh? maybe he's like a Richard Branson type or something. He has an airline, yeah, he yeah. has a bunch yeah. of media company, and she's out there and just sees the plane coming by and looks With at the tail stab and sees like his big head on it and it's like what? the hell am I got myself I in? saw a guy that looks exactly right. like you. Yeah. Right. No, he, she, well, he's, by the way, he's planning to propose at this point. Right, right. And the old timers helping him through the proposal and, you know, how to do it officially and what's respectful and stuff. And then she's gone. She's gone. That See, they never explain. They just leave. But now he's got to fall back on his tech side to find her. You know, because she's so she leaves off. the community. She, she goes leaves. into the real she's world, so sort of. She goes into to be the a real business woman. room, spring of sort of. She Re- just flips right. out and is this right. what you want? Right. She freaks, and now he's got to use his specific field of expertise yeah. to find to find her yeah. and convince her that look, I know I lied about being a farmer, but everything mm-hmm. else, yeah, that was really me. And, and we mis- have <laughs> we have the reveal. The re- the reveals at the end when they you know they come back together then we we smash cut to two years later and it's him and it's her and they're like tending uh, some some uh, tomato vines and they're tending to plants and they have their hands are in the soil or something and she she goes this is I told you this was a better life or something and they pull back and it's on 
on a huge penthouse yeah. in Manhattan, uh, just overlooking, and and overlooking, <laughs> yeah. overlooking the city, right? Yeah. That's the yeah, album, yeah, right? Yeah. And then Mr. Miyagi guy's in the hot tub, the dad, and he goes, he goes, he goes man, we really bought the farm. And they all yeah. laugh and right. they sit mimosas. Freeze. Yeah. Freeze. Freeze. Oh. Freeze. Oh. Are we going to freeze? Yeah. Yeah. Freeze. They, yeah, they did it on the Everybody so long. Yeah. wants to rule the yeah, world. That was good enough for Love Boat. <laughs> yeah. It'll work here. Roll credits. Roll yeah. credits. Oh, yeah. yeah, the big freeze laugh. That was at the end of Chips. Yeah. At the yeah. end of Chips, they they do the... I'm a big fan of that. You know, police mean, squad or whatever, they would do that too. They did Chips, and they started doing it on the Love Boat in like season five, because I'm keeping, I'm keeping sure. track. What's the reason to not bring that back? Just because it's too... It's just of that time. The Love Boat? <laughs> oh, yeah. I mean, the, the freeze. Chips, the freeze. Or, oh, the, the freeze. The comic yeah. freeze. Did one of the Top Guns end in a freeze? I feel like oh, I, I have a call. visual. Oh, great call. Yeah. 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 On yeah. the beach or like smiling oh. Tom Cruise? Am I crazy? If not, yeah. can I just get a picture of you doing that? They've, you got a great, <laughs> Matt, you got a great freeze. <laughs> the best freeze, is yet but, to come. A great, I'll tell you a great movie That's that great. ended in a freeze. <laughs> like a legitimately strong movie that I absolutely loved, which was Breaking Away. Mm. About yeah. the cyclists Bike, in yeah. Indiana, Indiana, which is a great movie. Cutters. The Cutters versus the, the college students. Townies. That or, yeah. ended in a freeze. Did it? Yeah. Yes. Find the end, Ben. Yeah. In fact, that and movie that, Lucas ended find in a freeze, the end maybe? of uh, Breaking Away. Yeah. Young Dennis Quaid. Yeah, that's a good movie. Yeah. And Matt yeah. brought up Police Guard. What they would do is they would fake the freeze frame. <laughs> yeah. And, and then there'd be kind right. of shaking a little bit. Like and then there'd be a rest. monkey in the scene the moving around <laughs> <laughs> or whatever. Yeah, it was really funny. Yeah, I love... By uh, the way, love just police saying crime. Dennis Quaid, that's who plays the Miyagi dad guy. Mm. He'd be perfect. He'd be something. great. Oh, yeah. He'd yeah. grow a beard. He'd, he'd grow a beard in yeah. a heartbeat. He could look wise. Yeah. Man, he's just got and the he's voice. He's fit got... like a farmer. Oh, yeah. 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 Great you believe shape. that guy. Him or Bacon. Yeah. Yeah, I I think Quaid. Quaid, yeah. Yeah. He's versatile. All right. Well, let's see if we have the end of that. Uh, David? I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> Did he mean it? Uh, I think he meant it. Can we get another take of that, Dave, for our egos? Oh, hey. <laughs> All right, this is the, <laughs> the end. end of, we're at the end of Breaking Away. Daniel Stern. Ah, there it is. Wow. No, it... Wait, is that... Wait does, does it end in a double freeze? No, because there's that a, the a, end. There's a that was button. an alternate. That, that was the end. That was an alternate. Yeah, yeah. there's a. There's Karate a, Kid ends in a freeze frame too. I think same way, right? Like, I think oh, you're right. Yeah. Let's bring it back. Rocky might even. I think this yeah. yes. one end where the punches yes. are thrown. Yes, we need so to the bring freeze it. is common. Yeah. Let's I, bring I, it I, back. Yeah, I thought I it was more it's TV. great. I just, I, yeah, that's what I was asking. I think it was of that time, but it's like kind of a pretty. I don't know. It's an epic way to Cool Runnings. Feels like it should have ended in it, but I think yeah, it ended with a picture of John Candy. Rightfully so. Oh, yeah. Yeah. That's a good idea. Yeah. Paul Dooley was the dad. Great actor. Love Paul Dooley. He Love is a Paul great Dooley. actor. Yeah. He and is a great actor. Underrated comedic actor. And he ended that movie breaking away in a freeze, if I, if I recall. And this is why I got laid so much in the 80s. <laughs> I is bet. Because it was all talk about Paul Dooley. <laughs> <laughs> he was in Popeye, too, Paul Dooley. Who did he play? Was he? Uh, I can't. Uh, was he Bluto? Was he the bad? Like I don't remember. I didn't. Yeah. I didn't see the Robin Williams Popeye movie. I. Yeah. It's weird that somebody made a freeze, a fake freeze. That's of, how effective they are. That's how. That's how good they it should have. Why don't we end this ended. podcast in a freeze? All right, I would love to. You're right, <laughs> but yeah. but somebody's got to make a joke. Yeah, there has to be a celebration. Will you tell me or... when we're about to end, and we'll we'll figure it out. Paul, it's gonna L. be the last Smith. thing we do, right? Paul L. Smith was Bluto. Okay, I. I Paul Dooley was not in that movie? I don't know. Paul right. I thought Smith he was, was in Popeye. I stand corrected. And then, uh, can you find the end of Breaking Away just to see if I got my my Paul Dooley freeze reference right? Uh, movie that should Paul be seen. Paul Dooley was wimpy. Wimpy. He was wimpy. There That's, you go. You. How did yeah. I not know that? You Shame knew enough. Me. You knew way more than we knew. Um, yeah, well, I made a movie called The Hammer. I made a boxing movie, and I really just made it the same i all i ever did was think of breaking away i was like that's a that's a template for a sports movie oh, yeah. not big and over the top just a, that's what a small 
sports movie that's not even really a sports movie mm. should look like. So everyone should go. Yeah, because them getting T-shirts was a big deal. Right. In a small movie. T-shirts right. with your names on it. That was a big moment. Oh, in my neighborhood, yeah. If you, yeah. Had, your, if you had your name on a T-shirt, you're a rich kid. Yeah. I, I went to high school, uh, junior high, with a kid named Todd Euler. He had a custom airbrush shirt that he got when he was skiing. That said, like ski oiler on it, and I was like, "He's oh got to be fucking God. wealthy. You got to be. You He's need real. To the fund. In, you need real generational wealth. <laughs> oh yeah, to get a to t-shirt. It Not only is your name on it, but there's a caricature cool that that had to be eleven dollars. Yeah. That had to be eleven dollars. Yeah. Yeah. That's like five sandwiches. Yeah. I mean, are you kidding me? Oh yeah. <laughs> All right. If we don't have Dooley at the end, the, 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 they have a cult. You know, the Breakaway has a button ending they have like the ending and then they have the like one year later or i just something. remember one other thing i brought back from tijuana you remember they would stretch the pepsi bottle into like a gooseneck yes they were they were selling those down there too you guys missed all the fun with pepsi bottles <laughs> seven up bottles yeah. there and, and but not only Sounds that like people they'd heat them up and yeah. stretch the yeah. neck yeah. and bend it so it looked yeah. like a flamingo snack. yeah all right, yeah. let's see if there's a let's see if there's a Paul Dooley. He won the race. Hi. Paul's riding his bike. He's getting his exercise now. The button is the son of speaking Italian the whole movie, and now he's switching to French. I think is what the. Uh, oh. Do you know where's the office of the person? You must be in the bursar's office. Ah, uh, we oui, bursar. I was thinking of taking French, but it's my first year. Have you ever seen La Tour de France? No. No, mon dieu. The French riders, there's the best. Ah, oh, it was about to end. What you know, a fake that's out. weird, right? Yeah. Anyway, she's Paul Dooley. Nobody cares. Uh, I've got a I've got a joke to freeze on when we're ready. Can you have some piano music queued up for me? We can do this at the end. (laughs) We're about home, so. But I don't know how we. What kind of piano music? Like soft, uh, not Schindler's List piano, but. All right. So this is this is the end. Mm -hmm. So it's the uh, end of Out of Bounds, and it's Danza uh, (laughs) around with his buddies, and um, they won. They won. Okay, they uh-huh. beat the Russians. They beat the uh-huh. Russians, and uh, they're kind of commiserating. And uh, and he's with other uh, the guys that are in wheelchairs. Mm-hmm. So Dan's and the not... guy who was the black sheep yes. of the league. Yes. He's, uh, he's there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay, I'm with you. Well, we did it. <laughs> Everybody was betting against us, but we showed, we proved that when you put your mind to something and your your arms. To something you can do just about anything in this crazy world of us you know i used to date this whore and she once told me a very important piece of advice mm. Fuck, i can't remember I, you know, I, yeah i banged a lot of okay so I, I digress sports isn't just about winning it's about camaraderie it's about bonding and it's about figuring out how to dig deep and when i look around at all you guys i go we did it we rolled with it. You got to laugh, though. Matt, Matt, was a, <laughs> Matt was a beat late on that one. Sorry. I, I, what, what is this lead? Was that the applause? Like, what is that gesture? I, think, I don't know. When Dan just says, we know. rolled with it, if I'm on that team, I'm like, I'd be a little smaller. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. You know what I mean? I wouldn't do that. <laughs> yeah, no. Yeah, you know. need, a, some, you need a moment yeah. that yeah, launches yeah, 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 you. Yeah, 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 yeah. I mean, the speech is great. That's a hard I, maybe, moment no, to fill. Maybe yeah. I went with the, oh, Tony. I think somebody then do needs bring, to make a joke who's in a chair about Tony. Maybe somebody needs a big pop laugh. You're right. That was a little too sad. I, I think I think I may have button here. Yeah. And maybe Dan Dratch can help punch this up. But <laughs> I think uh, I think it's you go, and that's how we roll. And and that's that's almost a somber moment. And then one of the guys rolls his chair back over your toe, and then we have you like you know, <laughs> not on my toe, and then us all laughing. We're all laughing. Great, great. That's that's, good. that's, that's perfect. Ah. That's the out. Yeah, that's, that's the good. Out. Yeah, that's I like good. that. That's Roll like credits. a bad news bears ending. I like that. All right, uh, bad news bears. <laughs> Kelly Leak was also in. 
Uh, what's the, Jaws? What is that crazy actor's Jackie name? Earl Jackie Haley? Earl oh, yeah. Haley was in Semi Pro. He, mm. he was yeah. in Bad so News Bears good. and Breaking Away. Oh, he was. That's him. Yeah. Good connect. He was good. He was good. He is good. And then he know. took like a 37-year hiatus and then came back as like Children of Men or something yeah. or something and, and then like got nominated for an Academy Award. Yeah. So well, guess what? He's playing uh he's he, we'll give him something and bought the farm. There's yeah. <laughs> well, oh, awesome. yeah. A tractor fixer or something. All you right. still say that? 